We should have turned left back there. No, I'm absolutely positive it was right. We're going the right way, believe me. Oh, hell. Well, maybe you can write about crime. Let's see your license, boy. Take it out of the wallet. Hey, uh, what seems to be the problem, Sheriff? I didn't think I was speeding. No, you weren't speeding. What are you doing in this valley? Just passing through. You planning on staying long? Not particularly. Hey, what's going on here? Are you gonna give me a ticket or what? Calm down, boy. I want to give you a piece of good advice. The people in this valley don't care too much for strangers. Is that all? Yeah, that's all. Uh, you two be on your best behavior. Oh, okay. Luther, give him back his license. Certainly, Sheriff. City kids. Yeah. What was that all about? I don't know. They sounded like they got their dialogue out of some third-rate western. <laughs> we don't cotton much to strangers in easier parts. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> Yes, I do, Charles. Actually, it's very comfortable here. Why is this bar closed? I mean, most of the others around here closed during the 1930s, didn't they? Oh, yes. Financial problems, I suppose. And then there were some rumors about the, the owner and his wife. Who comes in? Oh, the usual sort, Charles. People will always find something to talk about, and it's usually cruel and untrue. But why did you stay here? Well, I had no place else to go. My father was head caretaker here, and we lived on here together for two or three years after the place closed. And then my father died. Then I stayed on. Well, how old were you when he died? Oh, I guess I was about your age, child. Just a young girl. Hmm. I've always loved it here. This spa was the biggest, the most expensive, and the most beautiful in the valley. Oh, but that was a long time ago. Another day. These rooms look very comfortable. You use them.
you said that, that you didn't believe all that nonsense. Oh, I've always said that's just foolish talk. And then the, the... Oh, what kind of talk? Well, the story goes like this. But mind you, I don't believe a word of it. I figure it's the old people in the valley talking. Well? Well, okay. Back in 1930 or so,
get the key to the padlocked room. That will prove it to John. 